happy Monday. You might notice that the footage from last week just ends on Wednesday I think it is. Um, I'm very annoyed. So last night I was getting ready to upload the video for this evening and somehow I managed to delete a lot of the clips that are in this week's video and I permanently deleted them and I can't get them back. I spent hours and hours and hours last night until like one o'clock in the morning, hence why I look so tired trying to use software to um, recover the video clips and I just, I couldn't manage to get them back. So yeah, I'm sorry that there's a lot of footage that is actually missing, but I'm going to try and fill you in this week on what I was doing last week and there's nothing I can do. I'm really annoyed about it. I'm trying not to be annoyed about it, but it's difficult because I know it was my fault, like the video is being deleted. So anyway, I'm just gonna have to move on and forget about it. So to give you a little update on what I was up to last week, I was mainly focusing on extracting the tissues of one of the organisms I collected in Oban, which you would have seen in two videos back, the research field trip that I went on to collect samples. So I've been trying to do the methanol extractions and get all the, the extracts dried, but oh my gosh, I have such large volumes of extract, which is good because the extract is basically an accumulation of all of the compounds that you can extract from the tissues. And the more extract I have, the more chance I have of isolating pure compounds in good amounts that I can do NMR and mass spectrometry and figure out what the compounds are. So I know it sounds like I'm complaining about having a lot of extracts, it's just that it takes a long time to dry on the rotavaps. And um, yeah, I want to try and get it done before I go to California. Speaking of California, I'm going to the conference on Thursday, so I'm traveling to America on Thursday. How has this come around so quickly? Honestly, it blows my mind. But I received my poster last week, which is really exciting. I will show you that at some point in this vlog. It's huge, it's an A0 poster and it's absolutely massive. I've never seen anything like it. Uh, yeah. Yeah, so I'm very excited to go to the USA, but like I say, I'm going on Thursday, so I have a lot of things to try and finish in the lab before I head to California. I also sent my presentation for the conference to my supervisor this morning, so hopefully that's all good and I can use that to present at the conference on Saturday. Oh! So another super exciting thing that happened last week was that my paper was published. So it's so exciting to see my paper in its full form online. And I also printed off like loads of copies. 
<laughs> of my paper to give to my friends and my family. So I'm going to insert a little clip that I did not delete um, from the day that my paper was um, published. Or maybe it was the day after, I can't remember. But I will insert that now. Ta-da! Here is my paper. How exciting! I know it's back to front because I'm actually using my front camera. Is it back to front? I don't know. It looks back to front for me just now. So it's not actually this thick. This is like multiple copies. But yeah, if you want to read my paper, I'll put the link down below and feel free to give it a read. So yes, lots of exciting things were happening last week, which I did try to record in real time, but I lost the footage. Anyway, um, something else that I was working on last week was the second part of a study I'm doing for a paper that I'm writing. So I've stained the biofilms in those plates this morning, just waiting for them to dry. Then I'll go to the plate reader, I'll get the results, I'll analyze the data, and hopefully that data is good and we can use it for the paper. Yeah, so busy, busy, busy guys. And like I say, I'm very tired today but I'm going to power through and I'm going to get through the day. <laughs> I can't think of any more updates, um, but I will try and take you along with me this week and show you how I'm preparing to go to the conference and to go to America as well. <laughs> I have all of my plates here with the biofilm stained and I'm going to transfer methanol into here so I can suspend the, the dye and the bacterial cells so I can go to the plate reader and get the data. Hi guys, good morning, it's Tuesday. As you might be able to see, I feel a lot more alive and awake than I did yesterday. <laughs> Today is actually my last day in the lab before I head off to the States for the conference. So yeah, I've got a lot of things to try and get done today. I've got a lot of meetings today actually as well. But before I head into the lab, I just wanted to show you my poster as I promised yesterday. So I'm gonna go to the spare room and I'll show you the poster. I have just covered up my results here in the middle because this conference is actually an off the record conference, which means that they encourage you to um, present results which haven't been published yet. So this work hasn't been published. So yeah, I don't want to share it with the wider community just yet, but look how big it is. For reference, these are just A4 pieces of paper. Um, this is an illustration from my paper that my good friend Sarah made for me. So yeah, I'm very pleased with how my poster turned out. And I love these images of some of the marine invertebrates that I work on that um, my partner company of the project took for me on a dive. And I really enjoy this little scan me thing. So this actually links up to my link tree, which ha is a website basically, which has my Instagram, my YouTube, my Twitter, my LinkedIn. And I'm going to also have an electronic version of the poster on there too. Yeah, excuse the mess in here. This is literally me just collecting all of my stuff um, beside my suitcase because I need to pack tomorrow before I go away. So I got my travel adapters, I got head pillow because the flight is like oh, 11 or something hours. It's a bit crazy. And also got my COVID tests because yeah, still the world we're living in, isn't it? Yeah, here's my poster. So I hope you like it and I'm very excited to show it off at the conference. This poster is actually made of um, canvas fabric, so you can fold it. Um, so it's not made of cardboard. I don't need to roll it up. I'm going to fold it up and put it inside my suitcase. OK, it's now 8.40, so I'm going to go to the university now and I'll chat to you guys when I'm there. I have just been to empty the waste, so I've got fresh waste tank I guess here and I collected four bottles of methanol honestly doing solvent duty is like being at the gym bye bye samples see you again on the 14th of March <laughs> <laughs> 